We're trying to clear out everything on the brush side and we're gonna take ladder fuels out so they're not touching the canopy. Those living in Chelan County are working hard to combat the effects of climate change and an increasingly tense insurance crisis that's coming with it. Good work being done. They're trying to go from responding to wildfires to becoming fireproof. So that fire can come through, but it doesn't cause the damage that it normally would. Firefighters are aiming to protect lives, property, and insurance policies. Insurance companies are increasingly dropping residents from their homeowners insurance because of fires. Last week, the King 5 investigators first revealed insurance companies are dropping homeowners for what they say is wildfire risk at record rates. But homeowners aren't buying it, saying they've been unfairly dropped with wildfire risk as an excuse. In the last year, formal complaints about that into the state have doubled. This used to all be thick with uh, bushes, small trees. Homeowner Jeremy Britton has been dropped by insurance companies twice. He says each time he was able to get new insurance, his premiums increased by 50%. Well, I wish they would at least consider the work that people have done. Take a closer look at what is the risk really, just because there's, I feel like they're just like, oh, there's a wildfire potential in this entire area. And so therefore we're not gonna insure people. In the past, homeowners were responsible for getting rid of fire fuel around their homes. Now, firefighters like these are doing the job. Thinning trees, clearing undergrowth, and cleaning up evacuation routes. A big undertaking when the Wenatchee National Forest is like a match waiting to ignite. I guess you're on your own. This 2018 Forest Service report ranked 100 cities in Washington and Oregon based on the communities most threatened by wildfire. Four cities in Chelan County made it in the top 10, with Leavenworth at the very top. The city O'Brien is trying to protect. I think it's dire now, but it's getting worse. With fire seasons longer, hotter, and more destructive, the firefighters here are working year round. They're trying to show insurers they're going above and beyond to protect the community. We used to do inspections, now we're actually removing the fuel. It's not just firefighters. Just removing fuel and that's critical. Citizens like John Callahan are stepping in to meet the goal of making Leavenworth fireproof or close to it. He's the president of an organization that leads town halls. What we call a, a neighborhood get together. Arranges education groups and secures grants to help Chelan County prepare for the inevitable when a wildfire sparks. People are becoming much, much more aware of it. You get dry fuel on the ground. Now Jeremy Britton feels like it's only a matter of time until he's dropped again. He hopes to push back that date by protecting his home before a wildfire comes through. If I get dropped again, I, I don't know what I'll do. I think it'd be pretty hard to sell a home with uh, with no ability to insure it from fire. It's a worry for those that live in Leavenworth. What happens to a town when no one in it can get insurance? If people can't get insurance, how do they live there? For the man trying to make Chelan County fireproof, it's frustrating that insurance companies appear to be dropping homeowners no matter what. And there doesn't seem to be any rhyme or reason for how and when they're dropping people. It's frustrating, irritating. But the community continues to chip away with the hope that someone will acknowledge their work. That's gotta mean something to somebody. Fire Chief O'Brien tells me the last time structures were lost in Leavenworth was about 30 years ago during the Rat Creek Fire. He says they've learned a lot since then. This is part of an ongoing series. Have you been hearing from people who have told you that they've been dropped from their insurance? I am hearing from so many people. I've received a ton of emails from people that you might not even think in areas like King County, mm -hmm. Olympia, every single one of them has that wildfire risk as the reason that they were dropped. Wow. 
I'm actually starting to track it because there's so many and I encourage anyone who feels like they might have been unfairly dropped to reach out to me, reach out to King 5 as part of this ongoing investigation. And you can see just how frustrated they are. No matter what they do, it doesn't seem to change anything. So. Exactly. All right. Thanks. Justin. Uh, to learn more about today's story and get updates on future stories, subscribe to receive regular texts from King 5 about this coverage crisis. Text the word coverage to 206-448-4545 to sign up.